Losing weight and keeping it off can be a struggle. In this video, you'll learn why weight loss can be complicated and how signals between your brain and your body could be working against you. To understand the role your brain can play in weight loss, we'll look at two of the areas of the brain known to cause hunger and cravings. The first area is the hypothalamus, your hunger center. Activation of certain neurons in your hypothalamus can either trigger hunger or reduce hunger. The neurons that reduce hunger are called POMC neurons. When these neurons are activated, they release a neurotransmitter that reduces the desire to eat. The hypothalamus also has a negative feedback loop that stops this POMC activity and signals that it's time to start eating again. The second area, your mesolimbic reward system, is involved with feeling pleasure during rewarding experiences such as eating. When you eat, or sometimes just think about foods rich in sugar, salt, and fat, it can stimulate the release of neurotransmitters such as dopamine. Over time, your brain seeks to repeat those rewarding eating experiences. This is how your cravings can get their start. At times, your mesolimbic reward system can create cravings that seem uncontrollable, even when you're not hungry. Another important point to know is that your body is thought to be programmed to defend against weight loss and maintain a certain range of body weight. Referred to as set point, this can contribute to weight loss struggles. This range of body weight may be determined by your heaviest past weight. This could explain why the more you diet, the hungrier you may get and the more cravings you may have. When you start to lose weight, your brain causes hunger and cravings that seem uncontrollable. This is an attempt to bring your body weight back to its predetermined level, or set point. As you can see, two areas of your brain play an important role in weight loss. The hypothalamus, your hunger center, regulates hunger and the mesolimbic reward system can cause cravings even when you're not hungry. Diet and exercise alone may not be enough. Learn more about adding a medicine to help you lose weight and keep it off.